here at Amstel Light in Utopia, presented by Whole Foods Market. Hi, I'm Josh Ozerski, and welcome to Whole Foods Market Best Butcher Contest, my unbelievable meat event with some of the greatest meat chefs, farms, farm producers, and animals anywhere in the country. 11 of the greatest butchers in the entire Whole Foods Market system are all going to cross their knives today. I am proud and privileged to be the MC of this event, anxious to see who's gonna win. I'm really pumped. Never been in New York, but it's a beautiful place. So this is amazing. Pretty excited. It's gonna be interesting. See what they throw in front of us. There he is! That's Eric! A little nervous, but having a good time. Who do you think your biggest competition is? Everyone. You think you're gonna win? I'm gonna do my best. I've been a cutter for 40 years. I'm feeling really well about the whole competition. Are you nervous? Yeah! I've been in the business for 20 years and never had this opportunity. Have you trained for it at all? Well, uh, 19 years. <laughs> These guys have a pork leg here. They got to take it apart. The machine is doing a good job. Has some wiener schnitzels there, a little stir fry. Very good job. It's the home stretch to cheer on your favorite butcher. They're going to win a trip to Iceland and they get a Cleaver Award for 2011 Best Butcher. Hans from the Southwest. Gil <laughs> Baxter from NorCal. Oh my God, it feels so great. I can't wait to, uh, to see what's coming next. Bada bing, bada boom, I have a lot of sport here, so I'm really excited. I'm very proud to be here. I'm anxious to get it going and get it rolling. Once I get up there, it just kind of becomes second nature. Feeling great today. A lot of good butchers out here. The weather is fantastic. It's about 95, it's nice and windy. I, I like it. it. Feels good on the bones. 35 years in a meat cooler, you know? Beautiful summer day. I mean, a little anxious. Been waiting for this day all my life, so may the best butcher win. Hey. What is this piece here you're cutting? A Saratoga chop. I never even heard of that. These beautiful little rib chops here. Are you gonna bone these out as their own little rib? Oh, we got a little secret here. He's got some moves. All right, the time is at hand. That's it, put down your knives, thank you. From Massachusetts, Joe Melito. 300 stores, two meat cutters, three meat cutters per store. Larry Moore. We're down to four. So that alone is, you know, that's pretty honorable. I really like to introduce now Mian Parks. He is the director of Global Animal Partnership. Tell us a little bit about what Global Animal Partnership has done. Me and Park, come on up. Well, first I want to say a huge thank you to Amstel Light and Whole Foods Market for bringing us all out here. And to all of the chefs and to every single person here who's come out, braved the heat, to support all of these 11 finalists. I mean, truly the best of the best across the entire country and most importantly, for supporting higher farm animal welfare by supporting the more than 1,500 farmers and ranchers, 1,500 and counting, who have, who have been audited and certified to our multi-tiered program and are five-step rated. This is it, the final round. Theo, what do we have here? We got a four quarter square cut chuck. This is a major piece of meat. Calm down, five, four, three, two, one, go. Look at this, they should dip this.
this in gold and have this be the trophy. Big applause for all of your finalists. You guys are unbelievable. They are the best for Whole Foods Market. But the winner is Hans from Texas. How they always say it, I can't feel it yet. <laughs> but it'll sink in, it'll sink in. And um, yeah, I'm just really excited. And I'm, I, you know, I really appreciate it. The excitement of emceeing the best butchers contest and seeing all those great Whole Foods butchers working at the top of their powers was a thrill I'll never forget and the absolute crown jewel of Metopia.